Hello all, welcome to Sonos KB and today we are going to learn how to lock a folder in Windows 11. For this we are going to use our VHD method and encryption. For this we have to create a VHD file. For this we have to go to our disk management. Disk management is there in the options. So from here you can go or you can search in the search for disk management then you have to go to action select the disk and select action create VHD after clicking VHD here you have to browse the path where you can store the VHD file we are going to create a VHD file and for that VHD file we are going to put a password there just stay tuned so that you can learn this I'm naming it with folder lock demo and save I'm going to select it GB for 2 GB I'm creating it and a VHD file let's remain everything same and click on OK it will create a disk in our D drive a VHD file and in this VHD file we are going to mount it first of all we have to initialize it by right click initialize the disk click OK this will initialize the disk and then we are going to create a partition on this now it's unallocated now new simple volume click next click next 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 and finish this will create a disk new volume and this is mapped to e drive you can check in the this pc here you can see the e drive is there now here i'm going to show you that this is the e drive of 2gb and this is mapped on e drive here it is so this is the disk now this is blank i'm going to put my data which i'm going to secure with the password or a folder which i require for this i have created three different files these three files i'm going to copy and paste to the new drive so that i can put a password for this file so nobody can open it without knowing the password copy it now go to e drive the newly drive which we have just created now go to this PC here in E drive. I'm going to paste all three files, and as you can see, I have one PDF file, one image file, and one text file. We can try to open this PDF so that we can verify it later. This is my YouTube channel PDF file I have created for testing. Same way, I have created uh, this text file with random text of my own i'm a it freak i'm an it freak my password is password my credit card number is this so this is for testing only don't take it serious close it go to this pc again now this is the method where we are going to put a password for this for here you have to turn on BitLocker and on the next screen here you have to use a password to unlock the drive this is the password protection which we are going to put and create a, our own password which we are not going to share with anybody and whenever we eject this disk and reattach it it will ask for this password so make sure you remember this password otherwise your data will be lost click start encrypting as you can see this is going to password protected and it won't open without password so start encrypting it will take some time it's depend upon the data so i have small data so it will, won't take much see now this is encrypting now now close let's verify the data inside once data is there now we are going to eject it eject 
and you can see when we try to mount this disk back it will ask for password and that is the method of protecting your data with password in Windows 11 now I'm going to open the disk again which we have created earlier folder lock demo double click it okay it's not opening let's go to the this PC and check for it look at this this is showing lock and if we double click it will ask for a password so the password is which we have created earlier now we are going to put the password here and this is the method which I'm talking about protecting your data with a password look at this now my files are there and they are intact we can verify it by opening the any of the files which we have protected now other method is we can go to disk management and deattach from there and attach it back and it will ask the password again so this is the password protection method here I'm going to unmount it or deattach the disk is deattached now and you can see if somebody have access to this uh, PC and if he want to access he or she want to access my VHD then it will ask for a password and my data is there so I'm not sharing this password with anybody it it's password protected now look at this now I'm opening it again now open it okay and that's it it's mounted let's see go to my PC again this PC here it is the lock is there and double click it will asking for the password so my data is protected with password now this is the very simple trick which I did hope you enjoy this video please subscribe to my channel if you want to see such more videos thanks for watching have a great day thank you bye bye